Hello friends, welcome to my channel. In today's class, we will solve problem on job cost sheet. Problem number one. From the following information of job number three zero three, compute selling price. Direct material eight thousand twenty. Wages department A sixty hours at rupees six per hour. B forty hours at rupees four per hour. C Twenty hours at rupees ten per hour. The variable overheads are as follows: Department A, rupees ten thousand for five thousand hours. B, rupees six thousand for one thousand five hundred hours. C, rupees four thousand for five hundred hours. Fixed overhead estimated at rupees forty thousand. For ten thousand working hours, assume profit at twenty five percent on selling price. So, in this problem, they have given information related to material, wages, variable overhead, and fixed overhead, and we have to prepare the job cost sheet for job number three zero three. Let's start the solution. Heading: Job cost sheet. For job number three zero three, particulars and total cost. First, we have to take direct material, material, total cost column amount eight thousand twenty. Next, wages. In that, three departments are there: A, B, and C. A, sixty hours at rupees six per hour. B. Forty hours at rupees four per hour, twenty hours at rupees ten per hour. So this department A has worked for sixty hour, and per hour they are getting rupees six. B forty hours, and rate per hour is rupees four. Department C twenty hours, and rate per hour is rupees ten. Now we have to calculate the total wages amount. For that we have to Multiply total hours into rate per hour. So come to solution part. Wages in that first department A sixty hours into six per hour. Sixty into six three sixty. B forty hours into rupees four one sixty. C twenty hours. Into rupees ten, and the amount is two hundred. So department A wages total amount is three sixty, B one sixty, and C two hundred. This is the total wages amount. Add these three. Three sixty plus one sixty plus two hundred, and the total amount is seven twenty. Add these two amount. Eight thousand twenty plus seven twenty, and the total is eight thousand seven forty. This is called prime cost. Next, add factory overhead. In this problem, factory overhead is classified into two types: variable and fixed. First, we will take variable overhead. See the problem. Department A. Rupees ten thousand for five thousand working hours means if the department has A has worked for five thousand hours, then the variable overhead amount is ten thousand. But this department A has worked for how many hours? Sixty hours. Yes. Department B, rupees six thousand for one thousand five hundred hours. But this department B has worked for how many hours? Forty hours. C, for five hundred hours, a variable overhead amount is four thousand. But this department C has worked for twenty hours. So now we have to calculate variable overhead for sixty hours, forty hours, and twenty hours. Come to solution part. Add factory overhead in that variable overhead, and write the formula. Total expenses 
divided by total labor hours first we have to take department a total expenses means total overhead amount is 10000 of this department a divided by total labor hours total labor hour is 5000 10000 divided by 5000 we will get rupees 2 into 60 hour department a has work for 60 hour into 60 we will get 120 b b total overhead amount is 6000 and total hour is 1500 6000 divided by 1500 will get rupees 4 into 40 hours we will get 160 c total overhead amount is 4000 divided by 500 hours will get rupees 8 into 20 hours and the amount is 160 so department a variable overhead amount is 120 department b 160 and c department amount is 160 add these three amount 120 plus 160 plus 160 and the total is 440 next we will take fixed overhead see the problem fixed overhead estimated at rupees 40000 for 10000 working hours if the working hours is 10000 then the fixed overhead amount is 40000 but this job number 303 has work for 120 hours how 120 hours a has work for 60 hours b 40 hours and c 20 hours and the total is 110 120 so this job number 303 has work for 120 hours so we have to calculate the fixed overhead amount of 120 hours so come to solution part fixed overhead 40000 divided by 10000 total amount divided by total working hours 40000 divided by 10000 we will get rupees 4 Into one twenty. One twenty is the total working hours. I have written here in bracket. Total hours is equal to sixty plus forty plus twenty. One twenty. Four into one twenty will get four eighty. Now add these two amount. Four forty plus four eighty, and the total in outer column nine twenty. Add these two amount eight thousand seven forty plus nine twenty, and the total is nine thousand six hundred and sixty. This is called works cost. Add administrative overhead. In this problem, they have not given information related to administrative overhead. Nil. Same amount nine thousand six hundred and sixty, and this is. cost of production or total cost add profit so in this problem they have given information related to profit that is assume profit at 25% on selling price means if the selling amount is 100 then profit is 25 from 100 minus 25 75 is the cost Okay, hundred is the selling price, profit is twenty five, and selling cost amount is seventy five. So we have to make a equation that if cost is seventy five, then profit is twenty five. If the cost is so in this problem, cost amount is how much? Nine thousand six sixty. Nine thousand six sixty. Then profit, how much? So the equation is nine thousand six hundred and sixty divided by seventy five into twenty five to calculate the profit. 
so i have written here add profit 9660 into 25 divided by 75 or you can write like this also 9660 divided by 75 into 25 so calculate this 9660 into 25 divided by 75 you will get 3220 this is the profit now add these two 9660 plus 3220 you will get 12880 this is sales okay hope you got the solution for more such videos do like share and subscribe my channel thank you friends